Hello everyone, and welcome back to the Skulk. Now that Don't Open the Doors and Curious Expedition is done, time to put up two new games. It's actually really cool how both of the games end at the same time. I mean, Don't Open the Doors is going on for a, little, a lot longer, but now we have Stone Hearth, Alpha 20. Or, there's no dot there, so it's not 2.0, but yeah. So, just so I can test on seeing if the game works, I usually start, uh, whenever I purchase a new game, my computer sometimes doesn't work with certain games for some reason, maybe because I don't have uh, something, uh, a graphics card or whatever. So I turned this on and got a little bit of a tutorial on this. So, I at least got to see a basic on this. And I'm going to start off with this one, which I believe was something about, like, maybe the first set of people. I wasn't looking look, not too much into it, because I wanted to be fresh on this game. A brave, ha a brave band of settlers from Ascendancy. Ascendancy! <laughs> a prosperous and industrious kingdom. Seeking new lands and adventures, they set off to... Temperate or desert? Let's go temperate, because I like greenery. Nothing against deserts, though. Because it can be interesting. Darkmoor Forest. A location that's being blanked out by... Uh, that is peaceful, normal, or hard. Now, I think that it's a little more interesting if we actually have something. Because peaceful, there is no mobs, it says. So, let's go with normal. It's sure to be an inspiring place to start anew. If I recall, I needed to use the space. It had a little odd camera um, control. I have to hold space and move around my mouse just to look around the map. But we'll see. Alright, so 150 gold on the side. And I can get some things. Farmer's tool? Uh, herbologist staff? I'm guessing there's be, there'd be more when this is not an alpha anymore. But yeah. Uh, I got seven workers. Ooh, I can edit people's. Hmm. We'll probably leave them like this for now. If I play this um, in the future again, then I can I can think about some names. Or you know what? I can just think of some now. Let's see. Sean Tenter. Landon. Landon was one of my best friends. In fact, I had three Landons in my life that I befriended. All really cool people. Um, oh, one of them. I can't remember. Actually, the only one I remember was Landon Frost. I've never met him again since a long time ago, but he was an awesome guy. So I'm gotten him to be in there. I could be taking time to think about the names, but I, I don't have any names popping off the top of my head. At least I'll have a Landon Frost. Let's see. Loading screen. Click the map to choose yourself. Oh, yes. Now, when I was doing the tutorial, or not tutorial, just a bit of practice, see this entire map? I... Yeah, everything within, everything the light touches, everything that's highlighted, is actually what's going to be in the map. If whatever's not in the map, uh, light, in the light highlighted area, is not there. It's literally, uh, like when you're in the game, it's blacked off. You cannot explore further. So, if I want any rocks, looking at the side, um, there could be a lot of trees, and I want enough minerals in there, because... Um... Oh, that's a nice uh, balance. Three, three, three. And nope, I'm not going to use animals for crap no, for uh, for uh, that kind of game. So let's uh, let's probably go here. There's a lot of uh, some decent water, minerals, and such. Settle here. Hey man, you are smithy.
All right. So let's see how. Uh, let's see where we should land. Um, I use the right mouse button, by the way, to uh, direct the camera, and then use hold space to drag the screen. I want to be able to be near the water, so I think right here would be good. Uh, it's near the water, trees, and I can climb the mountain. Name the settlement. Summerford. Hmm. Let's see. What's a good name? This is a name I made up off the top of my head a long time ago when I was playing Spore. Of course, I named it up uh, when I was playing Spore. It said, what's your entertainment building called? And I just went... And then this came out. Sarambaran. Yep. <laughs> So we're in the city settlement of Sarambaran. Sarambaran town initial supplies. Description, if we're going to get this town off the ground, we'll need some helium balloons, some blimps. We need to ask uh, uh, Calcifer if he can lend us some of his demon magic. <laughs> uh, we'll need wood and lots of it. Chop down some nearby trees. All right. Let's get this. Uh, if I recall correctly, I go like this. And... Now they're off to see the wizard. <laughs> they're off to uh, get some wood. Maybe I should have stopped the tutorial, but... You know, this is my first time, somewhat. Need some place to store it. Alright. Design zones. De uh, designate areas of the ground for storage, farming, etc. Let's, uh... Stockpile. All resources. Uh, construction. Uh, use space. Uh, wood? What? Uh, okay. Wait, one use space. Filter. Contents. Uh, okay. Uh, open the citizen's manager. This... Uh, it, uh, use this pane to manage all your citizens, view their stats, and get and set their task orders. All right. Choose a citizen to promote. To, let's go with Landon, just because I I know him. Mouse over the numbers to learn what each attribute does. Mind the ability to think intelligently. A high mind a stat allows a hearthling to excel in complex mental activities, such as crafting, influences diligence, curiosity, and inventiveness. Body. Com com competence at physical activities. I'm not sure of some words, so forgive me on that. <laughs> Hearthlings with a high body stat will move a bit faster, attack harder, and live longer. Influences muscle, speed, and stamina, and spirit. Faith in other people. A high spirit, Hearthling will easily befriend animals and stand strong against enemies. Influences courage, willpower, and compassion. I want this guy to be... Oh, okay. I can't add that. Um, uh, home, uh, build. All right. Uh, change job? Click the carpenter job built. Okay, I guess land is going to be forced to build uh, carpentry. Click to approve. Carpenters and other crafters can create various goods to help your settlement. From beds, to building materials, to weapons. Alrighty. Uh, stockpile is there. Um, I might... Uh, okay. Okay. I guess it's going to be forced me in the tutorial area. Open the workshop menu. Use this menu to manage the various crafting um, workshops of your citizens. Alright. Click the carpenter's workshop. You mean that stump? Click the craft button. Alright. X on the window. Uh, um... 
Okay, uh, what do I do now? Open the build menu, okay. Uh, place item. Let me actually close this tab. All right, carpenter's workbench. Um, since I'm not sure about how this, uh, where to place things just yet, let's just place that there. Once I get the hang of this game, then I'll pro then I'll be sure to place things more properly to make it look more. But you know what? The first settlement, you, if you don't know what you're doing, then everything feels more homely because you felt you felt it as it went along. Congratulations! You got resource, a place to store goods, and a way to craft items. We're well on your way to getting the settlement off the ground. But I don't see no helium balloons yet. Uh, okay, I guess I'll just... Uh, we got all this wood. Maybe I do need a bit more of the tutorial. Um, filter? Uh, just wood. Okay, uh, none? Just wood. Alright, there we go. Just wood here. Um, what else do I do? Uh, place building. Place item. Uh, let's see. Carpenter's house. Cottage for two. Dining hall. Shared sleeping quarters. Tiny cottage. Probably need some of this. Wood. Wooden wall lantern. Okay. Looks like I'm gonna need a few more types of materials. Uh, crafting? No, this is mining. Uh, storage. Utility. Building parts. Yeah, I'm probably gonna need that. Door frame. Craft. One right now. Maintain one in inventory. Hmm. Maintain. Hmm. We only need like one door frame per house, right? Let's keep got going. Uh, wooden window frame. Have a maintaining of one. All right. A diamond window. Uh, wooden door. Oh, I had a door frame. Oops. No. Uh, orders. Uh, tall wooden, wooden door frame. No. I need door, an actual door. I didn't see the door. <laughs> All right, let's maintain one. And win win frame. Uh, maybe I should check out the buildings first. Uh, what what do windows need? Uh, what not windows need? Uh, let's see. Uh, shared cottage quarters. Mean bed. A mean bed. Why not a nice bed? A nice soft one. So I need a wooden door. Uh, wooden window frame. Wooden wall lantern. So I'm gonna need some lights and a bed. Alrighty. Probably not that hard. Let's see. A mean bed. Some log. Let's make one. And, uh. Wooden garden lantern. Wooden wall lantern. Uh, craft requirement, uh. Unmet. Um, why? What? What's not met? Required a carpenter level of one. So I can't make a light until then. All right. In that case, cottage for two. Wooden wall lantern. Uh, carpenter's house. Maybe this will be worth. All right. Uh, carpenter's tool bench. Carpenter's sign. Desk and chair. Wait a minute. There's more. Holy! There's a lot of things I was missing. Okay, maybe not. It was just that one. Cottage for two. That's fine. Tiny cottage. I still don't have a wall lantern. Um, how do I? Manual crash achieve carpenter level. Oh, you just need to build a little bit. All right. Can she? Hmm. Max health increased by ten. The carpenter can now make solid array of basic furniture. Thank you. <laughs> All right, so cra craftings. Now I can make myself some uh, 
wooden wall lanterns. Uh, let's craft one of those. Uh, can we make the you know, shared quarters? Uh, mean bed. I need four beds. I have one out of that many. Alrighty. I need one more wooden wall lantern. Some wooden door frames. So five frames. Three more beds. And another wall lantern. Let's get this gun. Gun. Done. Get, get this done. Three more of these. Uh, five of these. And... Three more beds. If it's a cottage for two, why is there four beds? Mm hmm. All right. And then, I guess in the morning. In the morning, they will start crafting. Town info. General information about your town. How your hearthlings are feeling and the wealth you've accumulated. Well, hopefully I can get this thing. Oh, you're crafting at night? You are a hard worker, man. Good on you. What's this? Ah! The wall lantern. So you're crafting them and you just placed them on the ground. Yeah, you placed them somewhere. Everyone to their own way of crafting. You picking a log right out of Mr. Man. <laughs> you went up to him. Hey, can I have your the wooden log you're sitting on? Thank you. He goes, oh, <laughs> man, you are working hard, man. Oh, maybe I should. Oh, uh, uh, harvest. No, uh, general. Uh, maybe I should get some more carpenters. He's you're, you're working all on your lonesome. Uh, change jobs. Uh, can I? How? Uh, require a carpenter saw crafted by the blacksmith. Okay, so I'm gonna need a blacksmith. Do I have a blacksmith? Mason? No? Blacksmith. Blacksmith hammer created by the mason. I am mason. Do you make that? A chisel crafted by the carpenter. <laughs> carpenter to make a mason tool. Mason tool to make the, <laughs> the smithy's hammer. Then I can make the smithy. Okay. Alright, so. Mason tool. Uh, craft a mason tool. Uh, to do. Uh, where's the mason tool? A rest app. Or. Weaver spindle. Uh, tools and weapons. Uh, where's the mason's tool? Mason's hammer and chisel. Alright, just need. Oh, we have stone? I didn't even go mining yet. Alright, let's get a mason's tool. And. Yeah. Let's do that. And once you're done making the mason's tool, then we can get started. Uh, is there a fast forward thing on here? Mm -hmm. Do -do -do -do. Settings? Okay. Well, let's let things go, and I guess. Oh, what's this? Man Frost has reached carpet level two! He's now a better carpenter. What is going on down here in this little green bar? Ah, cockadoodle doos. Um, let's see, building. Aha! Uh, how to rotate? Rotate with this and this. Aha! All right. And uh, we shall put it there. And we have all the requirements. Ooh. Uh. Once you've begun building the structure, you cannot, uh, cannot be edited or removed. Are you sure you want to build? Yes! Wow, that is, uh, wow. Oh, okay. Ooh. Let's watch a time lapse. I mean, I really should get other things done, too, but... You know, you guys can watch. I would like to time lapse it, but, but um, maybe you'll just see on the outside of our screen. We need to get some things done. Craftings. Do I have any? What? Let's see. The orders are, um, uh, these are done. These are done. Um, 
Maybe I should wait for things. Uh, do, do, do. do you have a mason's tool? Oh, you know, you're making the mason's tool. I can see it right there on the on the bench. Mason's chisel. Quiet remote. All right, you got that. Let's get ourselves um, the, the carpenter. Let's go to you. Uh, change jobs. Yes. What's this? Turbologist. In honor, steadfast, and resilient. Um, nearby advances. Okay. Herbologist. Heals units with crafted balms and bandages. Well, we don't need that just yet. Um, yeah. You are now able to be a mason. Uh, daily update. Um, Earthlings morale. Ate a fine meal. Oh, we... Oh, great. Right, 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 right. We should get a farmer. We should get a farmer. Uh, can we promote anyone being farmers? Uh, do, 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 do. Uh, change jobs. Can we be a farmer? Uh, farmers till fields and harvest crops, providing a constant food supply, raw material, and baking goods. Yes. Uh, uh, maybe I should uh, build a farm of sorts. Can I build a farm? Uh, that's not the that's not the go-to. Building design. Uh, We can design our own houses? Wall material made of wood, stone, brick, wooden wall looking like awesome! Column material? This is awesome! We can make our own people! Freestanding walls? Uh, slabs? Yeah, we'll go into that later! Sweet! Construction la uh, click on a wall or to build lab. Okay, nope. Not yet. Place item? Um... Nope, not that yet. Uh, crafting. Mason? Uh... Is there, like, Weaver, Maxsmith, Cook, Pottery, Herbologist? Where do we make a farm? Workbenches, storage, utility, weapons and armor. Oh no. I need farms, but wait, wait, down here. Maybe this is it? Mine tunnel, mine block, loot, nope. Design zones. Ah, farm. All right, let's close this. Let's zoom out. Let's drag this over here. 11 by 11, let's do that. And uh, fallow, plant no crop and let the soft soil renew itself. Okay, uh, let's, fast growing, but uh, pretty bland in its own. Fast growing staple crop, but not particularly nutritious or delicious. Pumpkin. Big, round, fast growing, but taste, it, um, tasty it is not. Hmm. Well, maybe bland, but we need our crops. Alright. Uh, oh, nice little bonnet there. Hello there, and you are... No, 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 no. Uh, back up, back up. Uh, no, uh, quit this. There we go. Uh, stop. Stop it. Uh... Elia Joville. Elia Joville. Alright. Oh yeah, we... What are they eating? I started this game off with some starting resources. Alright. Cottage for two? More like cottage for, uh, four. Alright, so in that case... Um... I might need, uh... Fight and defend? Nope. I'm gonna probably need to make some uh, equipments because that's your curve bow requires blacksmith. Right. Uh, mason. Mason. Uh, maybe I should get the mason thing. Whoops. Uh, boom. Boom. Let's. I need to make the blacksmith hammer. Require placement. Uh, place mason workbench. Mason workbench. Uh, I need stone. Uh, okay. All right, okay, I'm gonna get that one set up. Placing, not yet. All right, um, let's zoom out, and uh, I'm gonna need some stone. Mine tunnel, mine out tunnels and caves. Mine blocks, uh, like this. Is this how it works? Maybe? Uh, 
Uh, mining allows you to create underground rooms and corridors. You can also discover resources while digging. Alright, let's remove that for now. Uh, nope. Uh, let's mine... Can I? Let's try, let's try there. Okay, uh, I guess they'll get to it. Maybe. They're gonna need some more stone eventually. This plant's fiber can be spun into thread. Move item. Move this item somewhere else in the world. Uh, let's put it closer to the farms. Oh, wait, 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 wait. okay. Uh, uh, maybe, maybe not, maybe. Uh, maybe I'll move it somewhere else. Uh, let's put it right here, next to the other uh, ones. There we go. Still need to practice this. Uh, place uh, the uh, workbench. We have got to get a storage for these things. It's all over the place. All right. In that case, let's make a storage. Uh, let's put it right about here. Oh, oh, oh. Maybe I should... Oh, cancel. Remove. Place storage. Ha ha! Okay, learning. Learning I am doing. Alright, and this is going to be for construction stuff. Food and drink. Nope. Wealth and designated. As for the food <laughs> storage... Um... Let's do that. And this is going to be, well, resources, I should say. And done. I was sillies! I was being the sillies! Alright, uh, let's do this. Uh, remove. Uh, this one, remove. Those spots were holding one item. <laughs> I'm learning, I'm learning. What this? What, what be this? No, no, no. Remove. I am not gonna have a single tiny spot. <laughs> right, and uh, let's see. We're uh, let's see. We can have the food pile probably right about here for now. Uh, boom, 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 and boom. You guys have fires? Oh, there's a light. Placing the light down. Ta-da! Can we see inside? Can we, can we not see inside? Maybe I'll put this away. Oh, uh, so much privacy. Okay. That's, uh... Okay. Yes. Alright. Well... Now they have an actual storage spot. <laughs> now our people can not have... The stuff strewed all over the place. Alright. So, with the, the game's day ending, I think I'll leave it here. Uh, Taurus, don't worry. Uh, I'll have the next episode up tomorrow. And when I say tomorrow, I... Yeah, pretty much. Because I like binge playing. I get all the videos recorded in that ahead of time. And then upload them here and there. Uh, so, yeah. I'll, you can look forward to seeing this uh, within the days after each other. So, with that being said, have a great day everyone. <laughs>